Everybody would need him handicapping thoroughbred racing on Thursday afternoon, June the 23rd, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle East Coast Racing Report. Let's go to beautiful Belmont Park first for race 7 on their card this afternoon, 4.12 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 6 furlong sprint on the dirt track, fillies and mares, 3 years old and up race for an allowance purse of $42,000. Contenders number five, Lady on the Run. Number three, Gambling Geraldine. Number seven, She's Got Rules. And number eight, Spy Sunrise. Number five, Lady on the Run, is the overall speed and pace profile leader in this allowance field this afternoon. Sprinting at six furlongs on the dirt has hit the board in four straight starts with his last three efforts, including a win in his second race back, also qualifying as power runs. Number three, Gambling Geraldine, nice early speed abilities to complement for this sprint, has hit the board in three of her four career starts to date, including a blistering 13-length win to break his maiden in his first asking. Race 7 summary, number 5, Lady on the Run, tops the contenders list, which also includes number 3, Gambling Geraldine, number 7, She's Got Rules, and number 8, Spa Sunrise, 5378, in the 7th from Belmont Park. Churchill Downs, race 4, 221 p.m. Eastern Post Time, 5 for a long spread on the turf, 3-year-olds, an up race for a claiming purse of $51,000. $900. Contenders number one, Kajawara. Number eight, Grand Daddy. Number six, St. Joe. And number three, Henshin Hero. Number one, Kawajara takes a class drop of seven units this afternoon. Pace profile leader in this claiming field. He's excellent early speed abilities to complement for this sprint. Has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, winning in both his second and fourth races back, which of course is indicative of a bounce pattern, folks, and the bounce will be up positive this afternoon if this pattern continues. Number eight, Granddaddy, a five to one shot, has turned in power run performances and five straight starts, hitting the board in four of those adventures, including a trio of power run wins being embedded in this recent streak of racing consistency. I'll make a win place and show wager in this entry of his odds. Near post time are four to one or higher. Race four summary number one, Karajara tops my contenders list, which also includes number eight, Granddaddy, number six, St. Joe, and number three, Henshin Hero 1863 in the fourth from Churchill. Bonus long shots, River Downs, race five, the four to one shot, number six, Sadam, a Chilean bred entry, qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, is the overall speed leader in this claiming field, spreading at today's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. Charlestown, race three, the four to one shot, number three, we, 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 all the way home. The overall speed leader in this claiming field tonight is at the board in power run fashion in two of his last three, winning in his third race back. So handicapping for both Belmont Park and Churchill Downs on a Thursday afternoon. Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.